Yes. Uh, I lived in Marine for a time. On the eastern side of the city. Fucking bastard. So you wish to accompany them? You'd help the second Now remember guys to tell me what you're doing for your Christmas because I can see the chat. Only chance. Is that what you're saying? You're really considering this. We'll help you free the city. If you'll just consider what I've asked. We can talk about that after the slaves have been released from their chains. I believe that's more than fair. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. Seems like a fair trade. I mean, he has wounded. My men in danger. I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. Mm. What the fuck happened back there? Are we really going into Marine? Look, I'm, I'm sorry, sorry it happened, happened this way. As long as you get your arm, right? Best get. get your armor packs up in here. Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been. <laughs> Ooh, if Luke's could kill. Long time, Long time since we had a piss bucket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! Mm. I don't think Asher would, like, do that on purpose. But you never know. Mordrick <laughs> Forester in the Ironwood Grove. It's not your leg that's a problem, Mordrick. You've got to be practical. You got the best of Griff last time. When he comes looking for revenge. Do you think you can feed him? He'll be angry, looking for revenge. It sounds like you prefer Roderick staying down in the mud. Look at me, Royal. You can barely hold this damn thing, much less swinging. So, you're gonna give up then? There are other ways to fight, my lord. You can't handle a sword like you used to. So find another advantage. Surprise your opponent. Do something unexpected. Like what? I'll hmm. show you. Come on. Alright. Bring your opponent down to your level. When I attack you, drop down, avoid my blade, and swing at the back of my knee. Wait for me to attack. Okay. Oh, fudge. Quick time events, guys. Quick time events. Oh. Really hate quick time events. Now that's how you do it. I think you let me. Oh. My lord, sorry, sorry to interrupt. interrupt. Lena. She insisted, she insisted on, on seeing, seeing you immediately. Lady Elena, I'm sorry to hear we won't be sisters. Talia. Yeah, I kind of screwed that one up. Roderick, can I speak with you? Privately. You remember my little brother? Quiver? Good gods, Good gods, you've grown. You could you just, just call, call me Arthur, Arthur now. now. I hope I you don't, don't mind, mind us coming unannounced. 
But something's happened. I didn't know what else to do. Maybe this was a bad idea. I've missed you, Elena. I've missed you too. Truth be told, you're the only one I can turn to. Lord Whitehill paid my father a visit at Rillwater Crossing. He told my father you were disobeying Griff's authority and... And he wanted to teach you a lesson. As if I'm some token to be handed around. You mean... He demanded I marry his son, Griff. What? Lord threatened my family. Told my father if he refused, would be slaughtered along with you. Father acted the damn coward. He agreed, Roderick. I am to marry Griff Whitehill. That arrogant pig-eyed prick! Griff sits in my great hall and acts like the king of bloody Westeros. You can't marry him. Do you think I want to marry that disgusting pig? But my father won't listen. I'm not gonna be the bone they throw that howling dog. I'm not gonna be some prize for him to rip open. We have to get rid of him. Literal wording there. Literal wording. My father won't see reason. Lord Whitehill's made up his mind. It's time someone brought Griff down. We were hoping you'd say that. I mean, in Game of Thrones, when somebody says rip them open, it could actually happen. You brought your men. I command Father's elite guard. These men are trained archers, swordsmen, experts in both ranged and close combat. They're yours, if you'll help us take down Griff. The whole guard? Twenty men. My father still thinks they're aboard a ship bound for the Reach. Hmm. What do you have to lose, Roderick? Griff has been a nightmare for you and your house. You can't have any reason to keep him around. This could help both of us. Whitehill still have my little brother. If I hurt Griff, there's no telling what they'll do to Ryan. I understand your worry, Roderick. I don't want Ryan hurt any more than you do. I know this might sound mad, but it's the only way. Get rid of Griff, and you'll be free to use the guard however you like. You can finally take control of your house again. Please, promise me you'll do this. I love you, Roderick. I don't want Griff. I don't want any of this. I would be happy to. Thank you, Roderick. Griff won't even see it coming. My men are yours to command. Thank you. Good. Arthur. Could you give us a moment? You don't know how much this means to me. I'm sorry I couldn't marry you before. Maybe when this is all over, we could play hide and seek in the grove again. <laughs> Pretend we're still children. Forget all that's happened these last few years. I love you, Elena. I love you too. Ah, declaration of love. Ooh. And a sneaky kiss in the forest. And here we are back in sunny King's Landing. Oh, how I'd love to be in King's Landing right now. Mira Forrester. Our kings just get younger and younger. Thomas not ready. He's too soft. <laughs> Maybe that was the imp's plan. I wonder if Marjorie Tyrell will be there today. You mean Queen Marjorie? She was married to Joffrey. <laughs> For all I of one hour. Not to mention Cersei's Jane. The Lannisters have spies everywhere. They certainly do. What is it, Tom? Remember that warning you'd heard from Roderick? About Whitehill's contact? Did you find anything? Only whispers. But your brother's right. Lud Whitehill. Lud Whitehill is sending a great deal of gold to someone here in King's Landing. 
He's definitely up to something. Something big. I bet it's one of those Ironwood merchants. Lord Morgren and Lord Andros. It's hard to say. Lord Whiten is surprisingly secretive. They'll both be at the feast after Tommen's coronation today. Maybe you can learn something. I can't go. Marjorie's... She's not exactly happy with me right now. I've been uninvited. Couldn't Sarah help? Ask her to get you in. She'd do it, right? Don't handbangs look out for each other? We are friends. I'm sure she'd help if I asked her. It's a good plan, then. It's one that could easily get her killed, time. though. Just be careful, Lady Mira. King's Landing seems to have it in for you. You have no idea. you onions and crab apples at least I won't starve to death if I ever find a way out of it Must be the latrine. Uh, I'm sticking around to use it. Nope. Didn't want to use it either. Oh, wood's rotten. This is all bloody useless. Hmm. That might be useful. Never know. Could be. This one looks loose. Garrett! Caught her. What are you doing here? Thank God Carter came to help us. You're to be executed in the morning. What about Finn? He told Nobody them. Nobody believes him. Or don't want to. They think he's covering for you. Some are even saying he helped you do it. I have to get out of here. That's why I came. I want to help. You'd be executed too. Why would you want to help me? I told you my secret. And you said you were my friend. Well, what kind of friend would I be if I left you to die here? So I'm getting you out of here. I don't want to hear any complaint. I'm not sure I believe you. What? Why are you really doing this? I wasn't lying, Garrett. Well, well there is another reason. I want to go with you, to the North Grove. You know I can't stay here. Good enough reason. I'm leaving Castle Black, but I'd rather not go it alone. So if you're going north, I'm coming with you. Well, I'm not going anywhere unless I can get out of this bloody storeroom first. I can try and pick the lock, but I'm not sure it'll work. It's rusted a bit inside. I can try, but it may not do any good. There's a loose stone over here. Can you see it? Yeah. yeah. It's not moving, though. Keep trying. Let me see what I can do. Well, we can go down and see if we can actually get the loose stone. 